Good morning, Hi Crest fam. Today's Bible reading plan was Genesis 35 through 37, Psalm 12, and Mark 14. And what stood out to me today was Genesis 35, uh, verses 9 through 13, and I'll read those now. Now that Jacob had returned from Padam Aran, God appeared to him again at Bethel. God blessed him, saying, Your name is Jacob, but you will not be called Jacob any longer. From now on, your name will be Israel. So God renamed him Israel. Then God said, I am El Shaddai, God Almighty. Be fruitful and multiply. You will become a great nation, even many nations. Kings will be among your descendants. And I will give you the land I once gave to Abraham and Isaac. Yes, I will give it to you and your descendants after you. Then God went up from the place where he had spoken to Jacob. This is God's word. These verses stood out to me today uh, because this is not the first time that God had basically renamed Jacob Israel. And so I wanted to kind of know why was God reminding Jacob in this passage that his name was Israel? Um, and I see that when I read up through chapters like 33 through 34, um, of all the events that had happened, and Jacob's um, sons had plundered a um, town and stolen all the pagan idols all, and taken possession of all their possessions, um, which included their wives. Um, so all that was sin, and Jacob felt that that had ruined him. And so during these verses, Jacob had repented. He had buried the pagan idols that his family had stolen and taken possession of, and he was obeying God by returning to Bethel. He obeyed God by building the altar to him, worshiping him, and offering drink sacrifices to God. Uh, and God was reminding Jacob that he is who God says he is, not who Jacob felt he was, uh, not who Jacob, not his actions, not what had happened, not what had been done. Um, and this is true for us today. Um, I am who God says I am. I am not my sin. I am not my actions, and I'm not how I feel. Um, I repent, I obey, and I remain in return and always stay in his blessing. Continue to power up, pour in, and spill out, fam. Have a great day.